Hello, friends, and welcome to Back in Time. Friends, the Mariana Trench is the deepest part of the ocean in our world, although we have not yet explored more than 1% of the ocean in the world. But as far as humans have been able to reach, there is no place deeper than my trench. This location in the Western Pacific Ocean is approximately 11,000 meters deep, which is about 36,000 feet. It is one of the most dangerous places on Earth. The immense depth of the ocean in this trench creates infinite pressure, so much so that it would be like having 100 elephants standing on top of a person's head. In other words, if a person were to be in the Mariana Trench, they would experience such extreme pressure, he will die instantly. The water in the Mariana Trench is extremely cold, and darkness prevails everywhere. Friends, now you might think that it seems impossible for any living thing to survive in such a dangerous place. But behold the power of Allah Almighty, as even in the Mariana Trench, there exist living creatures that will astonish you. Before we find out who lives here, let's talk about how the Mariana Trench was discovered. Friends, the first attempt to determine the depth of the Mariana Trench was made by a British naval vessel called HMS Challenger in 1875. It was done using HMS Challenger. A rope was used to measure the depth, and it reached up to 8 kilometers. It was determined that the actual depth of the Mariana Trench is 11 kilometers, or 6.8 miles. Now, as I mentioned earlier, it is impossible for a person to survive in this place. It is indeed impossible to go there. But humans have already ventured into the depths of the Mariana Trench. In 1960, for the first time, two people successfully descended to its depths. Their expedition. Their names were Jacques Picard and Don Walsh. Both of them, sitting in a submersible called the Trieste, reached the Mariana Trench. The renowned filmmaker James Cameron has also reached the Mariana Trench. Let's find out more about it in the second part of the video. Can any living thing survive in a dangerous place like the Mariana Trench? The answer is yes. Behold the power of Allah Almighty as life exists even in this place. The creatures dwelling here, they are alive even in extreme darkness and the immense pressure of water. Allah Almighty is providing sustenance to these creatures in this place as well. Their numbers are quite low and finding them in the Mariana Trench is incredibly difficult. Scientists send something called a lander into the Mariana Trench. Inside it, there is a high-resolution camera along with lights that can operate in the darkness of the Mariana Trench. They have explored its surroundings. Fish are deployed so that the creatures residing in the Mariana Trench come to feed on them and their activities are captured on camera. Similarly, scientists have also gathered information about the creatures living in the Mariana Trench in a similar manner in the past. Meet the anglerfish. It is one of the fish that reside in the Mariana Trench. This peculiar fish has a bioluminescent rod attached to its head which emits light. In reality, it is a gland of this fish. This fish has bacteria inside it. It has a very large mouth, and it consumes its prey by quickly opening and closing its jaws. Another fish that resides in the Mariana Trench is the deep-sea dragonfish. It has a small size, but its teeth are extremely long. This fish also generates its own light. It has a kind of built-in torch that helps it navigate in the darkness of the Mariana Trench. It hunts for its prey. This fish is found only in the deepest oceans. Friends, this is a video from the year 2016 when some strange things were discovered in the Mariana Trench. They are called sea cucumbers, the skin of these creatures. It is said to be similar to a sea cucumber in appearance. It is also known that they have a toxic substance inside their intestines called cuvierian tubules. If they are attacked by a marine animal, they release their toxic substance. Sea cucumbers are found in many places around the world, including the Mariana Trench where they have also been observed. Friends, this raises another question. If the pressure of water in the Mariana Trench is so high, then how do these sea cucumbers survive? If anything can be instantly killed, then how do these fish and other creatures survive there? In fact, the creatures living in the Mariana Trench have a chemical called trimethylamine oxide, TMAO, within them. With the help of this chemical, these fish and other marine animals can withstand such extreme pressure. Nevertheless, now let's talk about another fish found in the depths of the Mariana Trench, known as the hatchet fish. 
The body of this fish is shaped like a blade or a swordfish. Their eyes are very large and positioned upward. This is why the hatchetfish can locate its prey even in the darkness of the Mariana Trench. Another interesting fact is that this fish has glowing scales inside its body, and the light emitted from its body it fluctuates along with the seawater, sometimes increasing and sometimes decreasing. Friends, this marine creature is called a brittle star, and it is also found in the Mariana Trench. There is a disc-like structure connecting their arms, and their five arms are attached to this disc. With the help of these arms, they swim in the ocean. In the Mariana Trench, there is also a type of crab known as a kiwide. It is called a hermit crab, and it is found in other parts of the ocean as well. However, it was also observed in the Mariana Trench in 2016. Friends in the Mariana Trench and other similar marine environments, various types of marine creatures reside. Only God knows. However, regardless, this part of the ocean remains largely unexplored. Friends, don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you in the next amazing video. Goodbye.